thank you so much. I, I can't tell you how exciting it is when I get to approve with my fellow board members a new charter school. It is the most wonderful experience. We, sadly, we have a lot of children in the audience who are actually in tears because they know the difference a charter school can make. We've approved this last year 10 new charter schools. I am a, yes. <laughs> I'm a strong advocate for our traditional public schools. We have some great public schools, but we also have some absolutely fantastic, inspiring, exciting charter schools. And when I visit them, it's, it's a wonderment of what they can do. They have schools where you have Stanford in kindergarten. You're, you're looking at Notre Dame over here. The kids are inspired. The teachers are wonderful. I came from a family of four children. My father was in the service for 20 years. You know what a serviceman makes. <laughs> so an education was the key to my door. Each one of you in this audience has a teacher that you remember their name of. You can think of them right now. I have a teacher in third grade who was Mrs. Remick. I thank her for being able to stand here today. This is a tremendous honor. I thank all the unsung heroes who are our teachers. I thank the CCSA for what they have done. They're always there behind you. Uh, as an elected official, I need to know what's going on with charter schools and what makes them so terrific. I'm going to leave you with this one thing. One of our schools has, Oxford Prep, has 600 children on the waiting list. We need to make that difference. There shouldn't be any children on that waiting list. So with that, let's make a difference. Let's have great charter schools. And it's an honor to be here. Thank you. Mm -hmm.